And with Charlotte not out of the woods, many of you have hit the stores only to find empty shelves and long lines at the gas pump. The question many of you have, when will stores restock? Tanya Mendes has been getting answers on that. She is live at five with what she's learned. Tanya. So I've actually been in a couple of stores today, talked to a couple of more who've talked to us over the phone and told us that they are constantly getting shipments, hoping for shipments every night. The issue is, though, is that there are stores on the coast that actually need all these supplies as well. So we're really fighting these resources as other places are asking for them, too. The good thing, though, is that when we walked in the stores today, we were still able to find everything that we were looking for. But stores are stressing, do not wait. The stocking up. Two gas cans. Two gas cans. Mm -hmm. Just in case. Just in case. Starting now in stores across Charlotte. Well, maybe a little surprise this early yeah. for Charlotte, but I think everybody's taking it very seriously. Hurricane Florence certainly looking like a serious storm as it marches straight toward the Carolinas sending customers marching straight in for supplies. We're already receiving calls from the Charleston and Greenville area about people at the coast needing supplies. And when that happens, our supplies greatly deplete very quickly. Sure enough, we watched as the last generator was sold at the Lowe's in South End. We just need to make sure that this area stays full of The store water. now setting up a one-stop shop of storm supplies. <laughs> We're always in the mindset to prepare for the worst, but hope for the best. In grocery stores, water shelves are already drying up. Pretty empty. Yeah, the bread, the water, the toilet paper. At Costco, long lines for gas. The store placing limits on how many cases of water customers can buy. The manager at Lowe's says they're hoping for another shipment of supplies tonight. Our crowds will continue to increase as the forecast changes. But at this rate, if you wait till the end of the week to get ready. But there's no guarantees. Stores may not have what you need. I think everybody thinks back to when Hugo hit and if we don't have power for, you know, five days or something. Yeah, nobody wants to see something like that happen. So we did ask today at Lowe's what the most popular item is right now. The one thing that they're probably not going to have. They said first aid kits is what everybody's going in looking for. Reporting live, I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte. All right, I guess we know now. Thank you, Tanya.